Hi, Newport News. I'm Corey Cloud, budget manager for the city. And I'm Lisa Cipriano, the budget director. It's budget time, and due to COVID-19, we are doing things differently this year. Citizen input has always been an important part of the budget process. And although we can't meet in person, we still want to share information with you and get your input. In Newport News, two budgets maintain and grow our city. The city's operating budget pays for everyday city operations like police and fire response, parks, street and roadway improvements, snow removal, trash collection, library services, support for our schools, and so much more. We'll share details on the next fiscal year's budget in future videos. Today, we are talking about our capital budget. The capital budget plans for large, long-term, permanent projects. It pays for improvements that help Newport News grow and thrive. Capital budgets have three parts. The Capital Improvement Plan, or the CIP, creates the timeline and funding plan for the projects. The bond authorization allows the city to borrow money for the CIP projects. And City Council appropriation makes the funds available to act on the projects. So what is the CIP? The CIP establishes a schedule and funding plan for the highest priority capital projects and equipment purchases. The five-year plan focuses on critical needs and new projects, including property acquisition, planning, design, and construction, facility maintenance and renovations, vehicle and apparatus replacement, technology investments, and so much more. The first year of the CIP is approved by City Council. The City Manager provides an updated plan each year to City Council. Change is taking place from one end of Newport News to the other. The CIP drives this change and ensures the city has the funds needed to complete important projects that improve the lives of residents while moving our city forward. And where does the money come from? Projects are supported by various funding sources, general obligation bonds, cash capital, user fee supported debt, grant funding, and other sources such as developer contributions. It's important to remember that these aren't just numbers. The projects in the CIP change our community and impact people's lives. Past CIP projects have included the new Atkinson Boulevard, Tech Center at Oyster Point, the Newport News Public School Transportation Center, and Lower Jefferson Avenue improvements and streetscapes. This fiscal year, which is fiscal year 2021, the CIP funds include public buildings at 38% or $27 million, schools at 17%, or $12 million, streets and bridges at 23% or $16 million, community development at 14% or $10 million, equipment purchases at 4% or $3 million, and parks and recreation also at 4% at $3 million. The budget department's work never stops. We are constantly reviewing the CIP and planning for the future. It's now time for us to focus on the upcoming five-year plan, fiscal year 2022-2025 CIP. Working with the committee of city stakeholders, our CIP process includes, from June to September, departments identify needed projects. From September to October, the Budget Department updates the CIP and provides detailed project presentations 
to the city manager and city council. From October to January, we asked the community for their feedback. In January, the CIP is submitted for approval by the Newport News City Council. Remember, only the first year is adopted by City Council. The 2022-2025 CIP includes projects that will affect our city for generations. Projects like the Choice Neighborhood Initiative, Stony Run Park, Huntington Beach Trail, Riverview Farm Park, Fire Station Number 12, the Sherwood Municipal Center, the Southeast Community Resource Center, and 23rd Street Placemaking. Here's how the current fiscal year CIP is allocated. This chart groups the projects into categories. It compares the prior fiscal year to the current fiscal year and shows the dollar and percent change by category. A full list of each category's projects can be found on the city's website. The CIP helps us plan for the future. So plan with us. Be a part of the transformation taking place in the city of Newport News. Ask questions, provide input, and please stay informed. And to stay informed, visit the city's website to view the CIP. We always welcome your comments and take them in a variety of ways. You may email your comments to budget at nnva.gov or council at nnva.gov. You may leave a voicemail message at area code 757-926-8734. And of course, you can always mail your comments to Newport News City Council, 2400 Washington Avenue, Newport News, Virginia, zip code 23607. Thank you for your time, and we look forward to hearing from you.